Disclaimer on. This video is pure for education purpose only. Please do your own research. Hi everyone, come back with us on the PuCoin Research Channel. This time we will analyze the Bobatama token. Is this legit or scam? Check this out. Bobatama will bringing you the first ever EVM compatible multi-chain ghost wallet. 3179 CMC rank. And this token running on the Ethereum network. Maximum supply is, 1 trillion tokens. For now, this token is only available on Uniswap with Ethereum pairing. This token was created on March 1, 2022. Four days ago. This token has been audited by Interfi Network. And also complete the KYC. Bobatama is a variation of the Saitama meme combined with the legendary Boba Fett character. The utility behind Bobatama is Boba Mask, which will be the first ever Ethereum virtual machine (EVM) compatible multi-chain wallet with Force Ghost technology. So it's allowing for anonymous transactions on the blockchain. These are some of the media partners that publish about this token. Let's see one from Bloomberg. This is their promotional headline. This news was published on March 4, 2022. The Boba Mask Utility. Holding Bobatama given access to Force Ghost technology. EVM compatible multi-chain wallet plus NFT storage. Boba Mask will be developed on Ethereum Virtual Machine, the software platform used to develop decentralized applications on Ethereum. And Boba Mask will also be a multi-chain wallet combined with NFT storage. Second, the Ghost Wallet. Boba Mask will utilize Force Ghost system which is privacy-enhancing smart contract technology to allow for anonymous transactions. Third, Investment Tracker plus Investing Monitoring Suite. Boba Mask will also take the multi-chain block wallet plus NFT storage utility one step further with the DAP investment monitoring suite. This system will allow investors to use features such as a growth and decline tracker, watch list, and alert notification system to fully take control of monitoring the investments. And the last, Mobile Plus Web3 compatible. Their mission with Bob Amask is for the wallet to be a one-stop shop for all your cross-chain investment need. Roadmap. As you can see they have already completed Phase 1. And is currently in Phase 2. There are several projects like. Initial Marketing Campaign and Influencer Partnerships. Full Force Marketing Campaign. First Boba Burn, I think it's a burning mechanism. Then there's Bob Amos Kalfa Development. Bob Amos Kalfa Preview Release. Bob Amos Kalfa Launch. Multi-Chain Utility. And second Boba Burn. Force Ghost Technology Research Plus Development and Boba Mask Beta Preview. And this is the list on Phase 3, there is a second check listing. And they claim, the first sex listing is in Phase 1. But I don't see this token listed on sex, it's only on Uniswap and it's a decentralized exchange. This is the team behind this project. No personal information about the developer, no faces, no social media, only personal chat on Telegram. The developer is anonymous. But one of them already completes KYC on the Interfi network, so if this project is a scam or any problem, you can contact Interfi to reveal the identity of the developer. They claim to have audited the smart contract, but I can't find a link to the audit results. I don't know, they haven't updated the audit results on the website, or in reality this project hasn't been audited. Since the first trade, the price of this token touched the first all-time high of 123%. Then dropped 55%, and returned to floor price. A few days later, this token broke new all-time high, with an increase of 149%. And the current price, dropped 18% from the new all-time high. But it's still 112% above the launch price. Swap Analysis Buy tax is 12% 2% for reflections, 2% for liquidity pool, 4% for marketing, and 4% for operations For sell tax is 
there is an additional 1% tax for the liquidity pool to 3%, and another 1% for operations to 5%. Their contract is verified. The maximum transaction is, 2 billion 500 million tokens, that is equal to 0.25% of the total supply. Yes, there is an anti-whale mechanism in this project. No limit for amount of tokens in the wallet. The ownership is not renounced. Trading is enabled. Swap analysis results. There is no indication of a honeypot for now, but no guarantee for the future. Because the contract is not renounced, developers can change the contents of the smart contract including disable selling. Buy and sell tax is high, 12% for buy, and 14% for sell. But 2% of the tax goes back to the holder as a reflection. The holder analysis. I didn't find any information about the initial distribution of tokens in their white paper and website, this is not good. Let's see the transaction on the blockchain. 45% total supply sent to this wallet. This is used for liquidity on Uniswap. These three transactions contain 41.3% of the total supply. They are sent to one wallet to be locked. We will check later. It only contains 0.2% total supply, so it's not important. 6.5% of the total supply is directly burned. And the last, 7% of the total supply is sent to this wallet. There were 73 wallets that received the transaction. I think this is allocated for private sale. Total holder, 1049. This wallet contains 39.2% of the total supply. There are three phases of locking here. Let's check. This is the largest number of locks, 28% of the total supply. This phase is only locked for the next two weeks, ask the developer what will be allocated for. This phase contains 5% of the total supply. This phase is also the same only locked for the next two weeks, so a total of 33% supply will be released in March 19th. Last locking phase contains 6% of total supply. Will be unlocked in the next three days, so a total of 39% supply will be released in two weeks, I don't know what the allocation is for, so ask the developer soon. 6.5% of the total supply has been burned. The top holder only has 1.5% supply, that's good. Holder analysis results. Currently no wallet is a threat. Because the top holder only has a supply below 2%. But I don't know that the allocation of 39% of the total supply will also be released later. The last, liquidity analysis. Current market cap, $5,800,000. Liquidity Availability, 239 Ethereum 24.8% liquidity is locked forever. This is the liquidity obtained from each buy and sell transaction, 2% to 3% of the tax will be allocated to the liquidity pool and sent to this wallet, so this amount will continue to grow. 76% liquidity is in this wallet. Let's check. Not good, it's only locked for 3 months, that's very short. Liquidity analysis results. Availability of liquidity, it's safe. 24% liquidity is locked forever, so it can't be removed. But 76% liquidity is only locked for 3 months, of course this liquidity can be removed if the lockout has expired. If the market cap of Bobatama token is equivalent to Baby Dogecoin, then the price of this token has the potential to increase 88 times from its current price. This prediction is based on the amount of market cap and supply token. Alright. My conclusion. There are three pros and two cons to this project. The pros. 
First pros, there is an anti-whale mechanism with a maximum transaction of 0.25%. This will certainly prevent whales from selling continuously but will not have an impact on small holders, because 0.25% supply is equivalent to $10,000 at the current price. Second pros, there is a reflection for each holder, so the number of tokens in your wallet will continue to grow with every buy and sell transaction. And third, the developer of this project has completed KYC on the Interfi network. If there is a problem with this project whether it is rug pull or honeypot, you can contact Interfi to reveal the identity of the developer. And, the cons. 76% liquidity locked in only 3 months, ensure developers will relock in the long term. Secondly, there is no information about the initial distribution of tokens, this of course will be easy to manipulate, and also what the 39% of the total supply is for, we don't know because there is no information from their website, I hope the developer updates it. That is my personal analysis of the Bobatama token. The analysis I use is based on blockchain transaction data. If you have any requests and questions, comment below. See you on next analysis, goodbye.